The plot of Neuromancer follows the story of Henry Dorset Case, a low-level hustler and former hacker who has been banned from the Matrix, a virtual reality space that allows people to access the world's computer systems, after stealing from his employer. Case's punishment was to have his central nervous system damaged, leaving him unable to enter the Matrix. Case is approached by Molly Millions, an augmented Razor Girl and mercenary on behalf of a shadowy U.S. ex-military officer named Armitage, who offers to cure Case for his services as a hacker. Case agrees, and his nervous system is repaired, though sacks of poison are placed in his blood vessels. If Case completes the job, Armitage will have the sacks removed, if not, they will burst and cripple him again. Case and Molly are tasked with stealing a ROM module that contains the saved consciousness of one of Case's mentors, legendary cyber cowboy McCoy Polly. Their journey takes them through the criminal underworld, where they encounter a rogue artificial intelligence named Wintermute. Wintermute reveals that it is one half of a super AI entity planned by the Tessier Ashpool family, a wealthy and powerful family who spend their time in cryonic preservation at a space resort. Wintermute needs to merge with its other half, Neuromancer, and has recruited Case and his team to help it achieve this goal. As they progress in their mission, Case and Molly discover Armitage's former identity as Colonel Willis Cordo, who was involved in a secret operation called Operation Screaming Fist, meant to disrupt Soviet computer systems. As his team attacked a Soviet computer center, EMP weapons shut down their flight systems. He and a few survivors escaped over the Finnish border, but their helicopter was shot down, killing everyone except for Corto. After months in a hospital, Corto was visited by a U.S. government official, who returned him to the United States to receive psychotherapy and reconstructive surgery. After providing what he came to realize was false testimony, misleading the public and protecting corrupt military officers, Corto snapped killed the official who contacted him, and disappeared into the criminal underworld, becoming Armitage. In Istanbul, the team recruits Peter Riviera, a sociopathic thief and drug addict. The trail leads Case to Wintermute, an artificial intelligence created by the Tissier Ashpool family. Wintermute explains that it is one half of a super AI entity planned by the family. It has been programmed with a need to merge with its other half, Neuromancer, and has recruited Armitage and his team since it cannot achieve this goal by itself. Case is tasked with entering cyberspace to pierce the software barriers with an icebreaker program. Riviera is to obtain the password to the lock from Lady 3 Jane Marie France de Cier Ashpool, the CEO of the family's corporation. As the story progresses, Case and Molly discover that the de Cier Ashpools are not what they seem, and they are embroiled in a complex web of power, technology, and deception. The Armitage personality starts to revert to the Cordo personality as he relives Screaming Fist. It is revealed that Wintermute had originally contacted Cordo through a computer during his psychotherapy, creating his Armitage persona. As Cordo breaks through, he is uncontrollable, and Wintermute ejects him into space. Riviera meets Lady 3 Jane and tries to stop the mission, helping Lady 3 Jane and Hideo, her ninja bodyguard, capture Molly. Under orders from Wintermute, Case tracks Molly down. Neuromancer traps Case within a simulated reality after he enters cyberspace. He finds the consciousness of Linda Lee, his girlfriend from Chiba City, who was murdered by one of his underworld contacts. He also meets Neuromancer, who takes the form of a young boy. Neuromancer tries to convince Case to remain in the virtual world with Linda, but Case refuses. With Wintermute guiding them, Case goes to confront Lady 3 Jane, Riviera, and Hideo. Riviera tries to kill Case, but Lady 3 Jane is sympathetic towards Case and Molly, and Hideo protects him. Riviera flees, and Molly explains that he is doomed anyway, as she had spiked his drugs with a lethal toxin. The team makes it to the computer terminal. Case enters cyberspace to guide the icebreaker, Lady 3 Jane is induced to give up her password, and the lock opens. Wintermute unites with Neuromancer, becoming a super consciousness. The poison in Case's bloodstream is washed out and he and Molly are profusely paid, while Polly's ROM construct is apparently erased at his own request. The novel ends with Case and Molly flying away from the Tissier Ashpool space station into the unknown future.